Hello and welcome back here to the channel. We are zooming out, taking a look at a new layout from Hexer. This is a track being released to his Patreons. This is a real track, from what I hear, close to Nuremberg and the Norse Live. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media, all of which are found in the description box below. Well, let's get to it. So overall view of the track, it looks very flowy. It looks like you could go either way. So we're going to go full rip here for today. See what it does. And the car we've chosen for today is that of my Drift Evo. A lot of you guys know all about this Drift Evo. So we're bringing it out today to test this track out. So we get the wheel cam and everything turned on. And we're going to go out of this dirty dirt parking lot and see if we can't get onto the track. So this is, like I said, a release to the Patreons of Hexer from the HTC. So if you guys aren't a Patreon of Hexer, make sure you guys join it. Link will be in the description box below if you guys want exclusive access to this track. A big thank you to Hexer for hooking me up. So we're gonna go full send. We're gonna go this way first because it looks like we can. Throw it in fourth. Looks like we got a little bit of a little manji section. R77 running the streams for HTC on Twitch. The Evil's already got some body damage to it from just, you know, being in the grass. So, this is actually very tight and pretty technical. Ooh, this may take a lap or two to get used to, but the flow is pretty nice, actually. We took out those tires. I expected those to move with Hexer's tracks. Competing HTC with all the tires and stuff we punted in the competition. Oh, we got a little airborne there. So I believe if we loop it around this way, which we are all the way on the inside, so we're gonna have to bring this back out. If we loop it this way and then flick it around the other way, we'll be going the other way. But if we come back here, we can do this course this way again. This track is definitely a lot of fun. That could be a very cool jump drift. Left foot brake, trying to bring this around, trying not to smack the wall. So close to the wall. A little quick Manji, a little e brake into this tight section. All the clutch kicks on that section. No! Okay, we can go through that wall. We're good. I thought I was going to die. Coming up this little hill part, little bump. Managed it pretty well that time, actually. Just a little dirt drop. So this is a fun flowy track and it's very tight and very technical so it's it would definitely uh, improve your driving style okay if you are not used to tight technical tracks oh we're, we're we beached it we beached it so we're gonna go back to pits and we're gonna flip it going the other way give it a shot going the other way like I said this track is definitely uh, definitely tight definitely technical but very fun so we're gonna come on to the pavement section and instead of that, we're gonna go in the loop, but we're gonna go left up that hill. So we're gonna come in here. And we're gonna get ourselves into a little loop. And we're gonna follow the tire marks this way. Take it out of cone, no big deal. Looks like arrows are pointing this way, so maybe this is the way you're supposed to go, but it flows good both ways. Oh, we would have taken that banner out if I would have had that as a full clip. We would have taken that completely out. Clutch kick on the inside. Kind of do that. A little straight line check. It's a little tight. Oh, man, that is tight. That is definitely uh, a lot tighter than I expected. Ugh. We're going to have to uh, give that another full send this way because I don't want to, you know, smack that track so this is actually my first time out on this track so I don't have any practice on this track or know which way it's going but I feel like that is the the flowiest way in there so we can do one circle donut around here it's a good way to like catch up with some cars or group up with some tandem people it'd be uh, actually a very uh, easy way to group up with some tandems and cut up in here Kick it back the other way. I'm going to 
try not to punt through the Outsiders banner that time. There we go. Clutch kicking it. There we go. Nice tight little section taking out those inner inner cones. But we're good. So this little straight section. So we got a really hard on the e-brake. Yep, that is a very, very tight turn. You gotta be ready for that. Otherwise, you are not going to make that. Running that outer wall if you can. Quick flick. So we're gonna come this way and now we're gonna flip back the other way which is very simple to do which I kind of like this track you can go both ways and it's quite simple we just do a donut and now we hook back into here I want to hit that with some speed I feel like we need to hit this with some speed and actually try and uh, get a solid jump drift on that because we could probably jump pretty well with this Maybe both ways. Oh yeah, we can we can definitely jump it both ways. So we're gonna try and hit that in a jump drift down onto the course. So let's see what we can do real quick. It's definitely a fun little course. Shout out to Hexer for uh, was coming out with some uh, really amazing tracks. <laughs> hey, you you can do a pretty pretty interesting jump drift there. So if we go full speed up the other way, are we going to go full send into the grass? We're about to find out. Who knew I'd be trying to do some jump drifts today? Send into the pole. Luckily, that tower was not solid. Because if that tower was solid, we'd be dead. But I do like this way. So we're going to... That's a fun little jump drown. I don't know if that's actually what it's meant to be, but it's definitely there and we definitely uh, can jump that. This track is definitely super fun. Once again, a big thank you to Hector for hooking me up with this. Can we go full jump on this one? I thought we were gonna die. I, I, I didn't wanna die. So big thank you to Hexer for hooking me up with this. Little look at the new Patreon track that is being released to his Patreons on his Patreon page. So get all these exclusive tracks by joining his Patreon, of course. And once again, a big thank you to him. I'm definitely, uh, I think I found a fun little track to challenge myself because this is extremely tight and a very tight course, but it's uh, a lot of fun. I'll flow this way. Flow out to the wall. I think we're starting to get the flow of this track. I feel like this would be really cool in some street cars or maybe some very high powered cars. But it's definitely not an easy course to say the least, but it is a fun course. So, you know, good work by Hexer for this. And like I said, he told me it is a real track that is close to Nurburgring. So, if you guys know where this track is or know about this track, let me know down in the comment section down below. I'd be very curious to uh, have some people, if they know what this track is or seen it before, to let me know. So I think that'll do it here for this episode here on A Set of Courses. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it and come back for more episodes. And as always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.